Hey guys, it's Angie here. Sorry about that. My camera was not working um, the last time, but I wanted to come because I don't know about you, but the weather has been changing like back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And I'm usually good, but this morning I woke up feeling like a truck hit me. Um, I actually woke up at 5.30 and then I was like, forget this, I didn't go back to bed. So my throat was sore, I had a headache. Um, I just, I was achy. I had an ache in my back, like, right? Like, wah, wah. so, um, but as opposed to reaching for the ibuprofen or the Tylenol, I like to, um, heal or soothe naturally. So I thought maybe some of you would too. Um, so here's what I did this morning. I got up and I had some hot, um, hot water with, this is, um, this is young living, but it is lemon essential oil. I also put a drop of peppermint essential oil in there, um, and there's Miss Ava. And I'm going to tell you about her and how she uses oils too. But um, so I did lemon, pepper, um, water. Let's see if I can hold all three of these. This will be talent. <laughs> and I put in some raw honey. So why is raw honey important as opposed to like a clover honey or? Um, a regular processed honey? Well, it's because it's raw and it's not processed. And naturally, honey has a ton of um, antiviral. Honey, you are in my light, girl. Mm. <laughs> um, it has a ton of natural um, antiviral properties, a ton of natural. Hey, Christy. Christy, look, I'm using my oils. I know you're an oily girl, too. Um, so I put these three together with some hot lemon water, and um, I will guzzle that. And if you don't have lemon oil, you can use fresh lemon as well. And it, um, actually, did you know that lemon has more vitamin C in it than an orange? Mama never told me that. So um, I, used, I used that this morning, and then I went back to bed because I was not feeling well. Then I decided, okay, it's probably time to get up. So I took a hot Epsom salt bath. Which, if, uh, if you don't have Epsom salt in your house, it just is a staple around here. It's awesome for aches and pains, and it detoxifies your body while adding some potassium to your body. Um, so I took about a cup of that with bath water. You can do a cup, two cups, um, and then some essential oils. I used lavender, eucalyptus. Again, the eucalyptus will open up my sinuses, kind of help with this congestion that I have going on. Um, I did peppermint as well. That helps wake me up. Um, and then I also added, what was the other thing that I added to it? Peppermint? You, oh, lavender. Duh, because that is just soothing. So I took that. Now, step number three to soothing my sore throat is it's coffee time because I have not had my coffee yet. So I have my awesome Disney mug. I, love, I searched high and low for this month. So um, I have my Disney mug, just coffee. I added the raw honey again. I did add a drop of peppermint again, but I also added, I had chatted about this a week or two ago. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. I added the collagen peptides to it. It's, it doesn't taste like anything. It dissolves right in it. And then I blended it in my Ninja. Um, and it was nice and frothy. Now it is like defrothed, but, um, so I'm just going to kind of stay on this regime of raw honey and lemon for the day to hope that it um, you know, really helps kind of soothe that throat. If you guys have any natural um, healing tips, I would love to hear them. Um, in my family, we use oils every single day. And whether we're diffusing them or we're ingesting them or putting them on topically, we use them all the time. And a sweet little story about this little girl right here. So I was like, don't do that. <laughs> um, I, I don't want to, there we go. Don't want your shirt there. Um, I was laying in bed this morning and I wasn't feeling well. And she came up and she said, Mommy, are you okay? And then what did you ask me? I said, do you need some oils? Mm-hmm. She, she learned so well. Mm. Oh, gosh. <laughs> All right, this video is over. <laughs> so teach them young. Oils aren't just for moms. They're for the whole family. And, you know, my thought is, is if we can teach our kids alternate ways to be healthy and happy, then that's our job as a parent. So I hope you have a great day. Comment below with any questions, um, and we'll chat with you soon. Bye, Felicia.